Hey guys, it is Kuda Craftster and I'm back with another process video, but I decided to do a Traveler's Notebook process video. Um, I just want to take a break from my December daily. So I have these three TN inserts that I create, well, except the craft one, I did not create that one. But um, what really bugged me is that I have incompleted Traveler's Notebook inserts. So for this, uh, I'm just only doing a one page layout. Um, I decided to do this topic in this TN insert because it's still kind of coffee related. Um, there's this game app I'm really addicted to and it's called Piper's Pet Cafe. So if you like coffee, you like animals, um, if you like the try solitaire type of games and you like to design your own place or whatever it is that a lot of games do this is the game for you i really love it i'm really addicted to it so i picked out three washies because i really you guys know i've been collecting a lot of coffee related embellishments whether that's ephemera stickers washi tape i'm like i need to do a coffee related layout and use some of this embellishment so uh that washi tape that i'm using is from hobby lobby i believe and I'm just only adding one strip at the bottom. And then this one is actually a very rare Modest Cat. Uh, if you don't know her, definitely. Well, she doesn't go by Modest Cat anymore. I think she goes by Bellatini on Instagram. Um, I'm sure she still has her online shop, but she used to be called the Modest Cat. And uh, I think M Mello, I think that was the cat's name that was her main um icon but uh like i said she's no longer called the modest cat she's considered bellatini now and so i added that washi tape towards or above that last one and then this is an old uh, heidi swap sticker that i want to use and i just added it on a piece of white uh, post it because I have so many <laughs> sticky notes or post-its whatever you want to call them and I need to use them so uh, I pasted that or placed that sticker on a white post-it just cut it out because I knew if I directly put it on the washi tapes or the page itself because of the pink and the different designs it wasn't going to look good because, you know, acetate stickers, they you got to be careful with those, <laughs> how you place them. So I'm using one of these washi stickers and I'm just going to use it as another additional background just to break up that pink a little bit. And I'm going to place uh, one sticky. This is one of my favorite sticky notes. Um, it's from the Smash Book line. It, it came in like in a two pack sticky note thing, like a blue and a pink. And I love those. Those are my favorite sticky notes to use in scrapbooking, anything. But I've been hoarding those because <laughs> I wish I had bought like two packs of those. That's how much I love them. So I placed the photo sticker on top and I don't really do a lot of journaling in this layout. Uh, I do place a sticker on that uh, speech bubble and just write just a tiny bit. And then this coffee ephemera I've had for a really long time from an old Citrus Twist kit. I'm like, I need to use this. <laughs> so I use my Xyron because um, I just didn't feel like using my roller tape. Because I've noticed that when it comes to, if, if it fits in my Xyron, I'd rather just put it through my Xyron so it has full coverage. But if it's, of course, larger than my Xyron, then I have no choice but then to use my roller tape. So like I said, I placed that uh, sticker. It says, you are the reason why. And it was from an old, I think I got it in a Citrus Twist kit maybe, I don't remember, but... It's an older sticker, and then this is a another washi tape from Michaels. It's from the Craftsmith like planner lines, those really cute like uh, 
planner line. Uh, I forgot who the artist is, but um, I I finally got a one of those washi those really cute washi tape sets, and it was just all coffee related. So I just add just one piece, just just so we can balance that blue from that coffee cup. And then I have this tiny dog from a planner sticker that I received in Happy Mail. And I, I was so happy I could finally use it. Because especially since this game has like cats and dogs. I mean, I've, I have these, uh, a lot of these animal stickers in my stash from Happy Mail. And it's like, oh, this is going to be difficult because I don't have a cat. I don't have a dog. I do have a dog, but it's back in the Philippines with my grandmother because I don't want her to, you know, feel lonely because I made that big sacrifice for her to have a companion. So I do miss my dog. My dog is, his name is Gamay, which means little in Bisaya, which is another dialect in the Philippines. And um, my dog is actually half Pomeranian and half Shih Tzu. And the last time I saw my dog was in 2014. It was three months. And now, whew, it's a few years old by now. But it's a beautiful, beautiful dog. So I finally do just a tiny bit of journaling. All I did, all I wrote was, you are the reason why I'm addicted. <laughs> so... Uh, I do add one tiny post-it by Cut It because I just wanted the thumbs up part. I um, didn't want to add another additional pink to this page, so I just cut the top part of that sticky note. And um, I, I do place it on top of that brown washi tape because I didn't want too much brown on this. Um, I just wanted a little outline. So I do stamp the date, day of the week, and time that I usually... When I do my traveler's notebook, some people, they just put the date. But me, I go all out. I do the day, like day of the week, the date, and the time. And uh, that's pretty much it for this layout. Um, it was really quick and I kind of like how it came out. I wish I had added a little bit more green, like just added like maybe two green embellishments in this layout because of that photo. There's a little bit green in there, but that's okay. Um, it's a cute page. I like how it came out. But anyways, that's pretty much it, guys. See you guys in the next process video. Bye, guys.